no libido Fly boys, yeah Slam club, nani yeah. I teach I hear my yeah Now they feel me everywhere I teach I hear my yeah For my eye primer, I'm using my Elf Blade Primer and I'm just going to apply this to my eyelid and blend it out. I'm applying my NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk. I'm just going to act as a base for my eyeshadow. Taking the white shimmy color and I'm going to be applying this to my inner tear duct. Next, I'm taking that turquoise color and I'm going to apply this to my eyelid. I'm going to spray some fix first to make the eyeshadow more vibrant and I'm just going to pat this onto my eyelid. Make sure to blend it into the inner tear duct color. I'm taking the shimmy navy blue crease color and I'm going to be applying this to the outer half of my eyelid. I'm just going to pack this on and blend it into the top with eyelid color. I'm taking my MSF in deep dark and I'm just going to use this to blend out the harsh lines of the eyeshadow. You can also use an eyeshadow that is really close to your skin tone. I don't have one so I'm just using this. Do Make sure to blend in very well until you are satisfied with the look. Lot of niggas fake hair like a toupee, waiting for shit to drop by my suit. Cause one fair roja, roja, poopo, just while on cool, joke, cool, joke. I need one fair lady. I'm taking my fifth eyeshadow by MAC and I'm going to be applying this to my brow bone area. I'm just going to pat this on and blend downwards to take away the harsh line of the crease color and to help to merge the eyeshadow together better. I'm going back into my MSF and I'm just going to clean up that crease real quick. I'm going to be applying some more eyeshadow to my eyelid to get back the color lost while I was blending. Come here to spend my money, chilling with all my party. Me and play just a jolly. You won't press pause. When my back on a press play, you won't press pause. I'm taking a black pencil by Maybelline and I'm going to be applying this to my water. Taking a makeup remover, I'm going to clean up all the fallouts I got while I was applying my eyeshadow and get my face ready for my makeup. I'm taking the Elf Alley Primer as a base for my under eye concealer. I'm taking my MAC Matte Master Foundation in 7.5 and I'm going to be applying this all over my face. It's a light medium coverage foundation and I really love it. I applied some foundation to my lips just to help prep it for my lipstick. I sprayed some fix spots to my beauty blender to make it moist and to help blend in my foundation better on my face. I'm using my e.l.f. powder brush to help buff in my foundation and help my foundation blend in better. I'm taking my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer and NC50 and I'm just going to be applying this to all my dark areas. I'm going to apply this underneath my eyes and I'm also going to apply it to the side of my lips and also to places where I have dark spots. Make sure you blend this in very well, just pat it in. I use my fingers because it works better for me, but just make sure to pat this in very, very, very well until you are satisfied. I'm taking my Select Cover Concealer and NC45, and I'm just going to use this to highlight under my eyes. I'm about to beat my face up, so I'm just patting this underneath my eyes and I'm going to make a V-shape under my eyes and extend it towards my hairline. Make sure you pat this on very well 
and you get everywhere covered. I'm also going to be applying some concealer to the bridge of my nose and I'm going to apply some to the top of my lip and also to the bottom of my chin just to highlight those areas. banana luxury powder to set my concealer and I'm just going to puff it on with a cosmetic sponge. Make sure you apply this generously and I'm just going to pat it on everywhere I've applied concealer to my face. Using the powder brush I'm just going to take off the excess powder off my face. I'm using my Ben 9 Luxury Powder if not Meg today and the reason why I chose to use this powder is because I feel my foundation is a bit light for me so this helps to tone down the foundation I'm just going to buff it in using a Kabuki brush and I'm just blending it in very 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 well taking it everywhere make sure you go over your highlight just to tone down the highlight color underneath your eyes. I'm using my CoverGirl bronzer in Ebony Bronze and I'm going to be using this to contour. I'm going to contour my cheekbones, my jawline, and also the top of my head. Also, I'm going to go in to contour my nails using a smaller brush and this is going to give my nose a little more dimension and also make it look smaller because I have a massive nose. <laughs> using the Ambrin Rose Blush by MAC and I'm just going to use this to apply some color to my cheeks. I'm taking my Elf Bronzer and I'm just going to apply it to the top of my cheekbones and my nose and some other areas and this is to help to give my face a little bit of play for my first lip color I'm going to be using Match Ravishing it's a cream shin lipstick and I'm just applying it to my lips and smack it in on and over that I'm using Match Viva Vamp 2 and I'm just going to merge the two lipsticks together I'm using Wet and Wild lip liner in chestnut and I'm just going to use this to outline my lips and to finish up I'm going to use max lip glass in Moth of Flame to give the lips some sheen and finish the look up with some fixed spots.